hey what's up YouTube welcome to day one of the 2016 May painting challenge so this challenge couldn't have come at a better time for me I have been in a massive and I mean massive painting slump for me anyways my output has been pretty low lately um, mainly because of uh, some real life stuff going on um, you can hear from my voice I'm a little bit hoarse I uh, just got back from a convention uh, Kingdom Con 2016, which was awesome, but uh, the painting is kind of slowed down because the inspiration is slowed down went through Ninja All-Stars still have the Ronin models to paint there, but um, anyway This painting challenge is just what the doctor ordered as far as trying to get back into a groove of painting and for this year uh, I am actually with my my second child on the way uh, I am going to be gearing this a little bit more towards uh, commission work, a little bit more towards, uh, you know, keeping myself in the black and keeping the books balanced and all that stuff. So uh, I'm going to be working on fun stuff, but there is going to be a purpose behind it. Okay, so uh, so here, this is just going to be a preview of some of the stuff that I plan on working on this month. And uh, we'll, we'll do a little bit every day. And let's keep you guys updated. So I will be working on Guild Ball stuff. So... <laughs> Every third word out of my mouth these days is Guild Ball. I love this game. I love this game. I love playing it. I love painting it. This is the Hunter Guild starter set. Uh, hot off the presses here uh, over at Steamforged Games. Uh, so I got myself a Hunter's Guild starter set and some... Actually, it's the, the whole... I have the whole set coming. Uh, so I'll be working on that. Uh, the plan is to paint that entire set and then just eBay it and sell the whole thing. So if you like what you're seeing, uh, you may see uh, the eBay listing pop up after that part of it's completed. In addition, let's move on. Got some of the Season 2 Captain's Fillet. Beautiful model. Beautiful model. Was not even interested in playing Butchers, but man, that's a gorgeous model. And I think with her playstyle, I am going to be interested in playing butchers also smoke uh i did sell my alchemist team to troy perez but hey i got smoke now i'm thinking of refilling the team and giving it a go with smoke kind of kind of a longer term uh project there i don't know if i actually will work on smoke this month because if i'm gonna do that uh, i am gonna refill the alchemist team and paint them all on mass finally uh, I have Hammer here, who I absolutely will paint because I love my Masons and I love Hammer. And uh, War Boss Tay uh, is working on a Masons commission currently, and I was like super thrilled about that because I was like, man, War Boss Tay is about to jump into the good side of gaming, inexpensive, tactically deep, sharp rules, lifestyle compatible miniature gaming this is where it's at tay stop playing them expensive games man jump into good games <laughs> that's just me preaching honestly i'm not I don't know, i'm just messing around just messing around fans anyway um yeah messing around about the messing around part but uh this is this game is incredible the miniatures are incredible i cannot i cannot oversell you this game seriously it's that good uh, so Hammer's going to be one of the, one of the early ones that I start because I want to play him. I actually want to get him on the field, uh, with my Masons. So we'll be working on him soon. Okay. Enough preview. No painting going on. I, did you see my live shows? Like I, I'm not doing any painting anymore. It's super embarrassing. Um, the other things I'll be doing is I will be doing another Game of Thrones rant. So... If you guys don't like anything spoiled or you don't like to hear negativity about your show, do not tune into my Game of Thrones rants because I'm a bit of a cynic, I'm a bit of a skeptic, and especially with stuff that I like, that's how I roll. Uh, the other thing, okay, so what's uh, day one question? I don't know if I'll hit all the day one questions, I don't know. Uh, this one was show off a talent or something. I, I can't really show off... Uh, any other talent. I mean, I do I do sketching kind of poorly. I do a little sculpting kind of poorly. Uh, nothing really there worth showing you. The only thing I got was the other day I got a compliment from a friend, um, especially after, you know, this past weekend at Kingdom Con. 
uh, who pointed out that I know a lot of different gaming systems and I can I can easily bounce between them and answer rules and promote them. Um, so I don't know what kind of uh, talent that is. Is you know he was like oh you're a gaming savant because you can you know and this actually happened over the past weekend uh, at Kingdom Con where I was bouncing quickly between uh, Ninja All Stars Relic Knights and uh, Guild Ball all at the same time. Um, you know, getting the rules straight, promoting the games, running demos, playing in some of them at the same time, that kind of thing. I think that, it, I mean, I don't know if that's a talent or not, but uh, aside from the painting and hobby aspect, um, and that's the playing aspect. And not a lot of people do like to keep several systems in their heads uh, and play them that way. Uh, and I guess that's, I guess that is a talent. That's also why you might want to pay attention to what games I like, what games I like, because, uh, if I play a lot of games and I know a lot of games and I'm picking certain games, there might be something to that. <laughs> anyway, that's going to do it for this video. It's way longer than I wanted to go. But anyway, uh, I want to thank everybody for watching. Let's do some May painting. Uh, I've got some stuff up on eBay too already because we got to do some May selling as well. All right, so thanks for watching everybody and we'll catch you on the next one.